Question. So you're a 55 year old now and you were a division one wrestler at is it Minnesota State University? And that was 33 years ago and you don't want to get injured obviously at your age. Is BJJ a good way to go? So first of all, respect sir. Most people will not understand what it takes to be a division one wrestler. These are top of the line of athletes in the world. There is very few things that are even comparable to being that. So high respect. BJJ is almost ideal for you. You can start BJJ at any age, even if you were untrained, and your wrestling experience will be a great asset in learning Jiu-Jitsu. The only challenge it will be your mind. Because with 55 year old, you cannot go into training with the mentality of a 22 year old division one wrestler. And in your mind, <laughs> you're still a 22 year old division one wrestler. And even if you have the attitude that, oh, I will go easy and slowly, you will feel challenged. People will, you know, like they will, they will trigger your fast movements and you will need to hold back actively you will need to actively focus on going easy going slowly going home healthy and as friends to not injure yourself you need to leave the competitiveness that is 100 percent very deeply rooted within you otherwise you would never have been a division one wrestler so you obviously are a very very highly competitive man but the competition that we are facing at that age is entirely different. You can be 22 years old for five minutes. So the competition that we are facing is to try and swallow that down, to stay healthy, stay smart in training, to let the young guys shine, let them move, let them tap you, it's all easy. The win that we take home is going home still standing after training, going back to training the same week again. That is the victory that we have. It's like in self-defense, you know, if I go home uninjured, then I have successfully defended myself. And if I go home for a, from a jiu-jitsu training uninjured, then I have successfully trained. I wish you the very best in your journey. I hope you take up jiu-jitsu. And I hope you keep that advice in mind, my dear friend, if I may, that you just try to keep it slowly, let the competitiveness stay at home at least for a while and just focus on staying healthy. Have a good time.